Quinn, some days you have good ones, some days you have ones that are a little rough. How was it out there? Yeah, it was uh, not what I was expecting for my first race back. I'm um, disappointed, but you know, we, I remember on Tuesday of this week, so it's Friday today, on Tuesday at 2 p.m., I remember I was just laying down for a nap and Jerry called and he's like, I don't know, should we race, should we not race? Um, I had just done like a pretty good workout um, and I said, yeah, you know, I think I should. And he's like, well, do you think you get a better workout if you trained in Portland or, so we actually made the decision to come here and race on Tuesday. Um, yeah, and you know, I came here, I, I thought I'd run faster than that, um, but it was also my first race back in, a year and a half and you know I know even when I take just like small breaks the first race back for me is always really difficult um, so just gonna take this and hopefully gain momentum and just improve everyone from here on out. What are the um, best ways that you have found that help you to deal with workouts or races that don't really go your way? Uh, you know I think the older I get the the less I let races affect me outside of sport you know I'm still a little Eh, right now um, but you know we'll leave and by the time I go to bed tonight and wake up the next day I have a fire in me to want to work harder to even on the warm down I just thought you know what this is great fuel for me to work harder um, to work smarter to just continue to put in the work um, you know I really haven't been training that long with the uh, with the team um, since coming back and I just need to continue to plug away